Hey everyone, and welcome to another e-learning support video. This video is going to show you how to participate in a discussion in your e-learning course in Brightspace. All right, let's get to it. There are a couple of ways to access discussions, so let's start with the navbar. Once you're logged into your e-learning course, look on the navbar for an icon titled Discussions. This should bring you to a list of all the discussion forums available to you based on the unit you are currently working through. If you access the discussions this way, you'll need to search through the list to find the appropriate discussion and then select the title. Here, you may see a description of the discussion or a message from your teacher about what you should probably think about before posting. To make your own post, you'll want to select the blue button, Start a New Thread. Think of this as the beginning of a conversation that you're starting as you answer this question. Others can then join into the conversation once you've posted an initial thread. You'll have to give your post a subject, and I would suggest making the subject that sums up your idea or post instead of using the title of the discussion. This way you won't see 30 discussion posts all called, why do you want to be a superhero, for example. So here I'll add the subject of, I want to help people. Then below you can start typing in your actual discussion response. Be sure to use full sentences and proper grammar unless your teacher instructs you to do so. Just like in the email, this is a rich text editor, so you can modify the text colors, add in images, upload documents and links. Now once you're satisfied with what you have, scroll down and select the blue button, post. That discussion thread has now been added and other classmates of yours can go in and respond to it. You can see how many replies to your post there are and how many you've read or unread. To access the thread, select the blue title and it opens up where you can read other replies and respond back to them if it's appropriate to do so. Once others have posted their own discussion threads, you can open up their threads, which is almost like their beginning of the conversation, and select the reply, reply to thread button, which opens up a familiar rich text editor box. Type in your response, select post, and the reply should be there below their initial thread post. The other way to access discussions is right from the lesson itself. Throughout the lesson, you should find colored sections that have icons identifying them as discussions. Usually they look like little speech bubbles. At the bottom of these sections, you'll see a link that says join the discussion. Now this is the preferred way to access discussions for the first time because it gives you the pacing for when and the context for why you're actually having the discussion. Selecting this link brings you right to the space where you can start a thread or reply to others. Anyways, I hope this video helped you learn how to access and participate in discussions, which will be very important in your e-learning course. If it was helpful, like, subscribe, do all that fun stuff, and I'll check you in our next video.